Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and this is Lumber Tycoon 2. Woo! Hold on. There's like a little bit of a weird delay going on. There we go. That should be much better. Anyhow, we are back in. It has been fixed. Oh my goodness. So, um, Defaultio, I don't think changed anything. Text rendering fixed. Uh, yeah, 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 right there. May 10th. So, um, now you can't say that he didn't update the game. <laughs> Okay, so that's a bad joke, bad joke. All right, <clears throat> this is your first time meeting a YouTuber. Oh my goodness, well, it's going to freak you out even more when you're watching the video tomorrow. And Caitlin Loves Unicorns is on the video. Oh my gosh, hello. I'm screaming inside, lol. And then this guy, I don't think he actually knows who I am because he keeps like, whitelist me. <laughs> so I don't, I don't know. I, he came up asking for an axe and he was asking for a baggy axe. I think he meant buy axe, but um, I don't sell axes, so I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Anyhow, I also um, came up with a little bit of a different design. I don't know if it's actually going to work or not, so I'm just going to test this real quick. Um, I'm going to put down a large floor. I have the power, so it only takes one unit to fill in. Uh, I made a, like, vertical one unit. Oh, no, it's just too short. Okay, hold on. Let's see here. Um, let's just let's go up to two. So I've got six by or point six by two. So what this does, it makes the uh, units you've signed. Oh, I should get back in there. Get back in there. It makes the wood vertical, and whenever it cuts on the saw blade, it goes across the grain, so it takes less cut from a sawmill but it's the same amount of wood. So I, I thought, you know, I could probably figure out how to do this and maybe do some awesomeness. What am I doing? What am I doing? Seriously, I've got all my controls messed up. I'm all flustered because yesterday it was completely down and I didn't know what to do, so I had to go play some jailbreak. Oh. Which you guys still watched, but I mean, it's not lumber. And I don't know of any game equivalent to lumber that you guys would watch that I would want to play. Um, except for like the tutorials and if you haven't watched the tutorials go watch the tutorials it's learn Roblox learn Roblox and it's it's basically it's studios um, like everything oh OBS is already running why is that cancel I'm gonna cancel that there we go okay cool what's up my favorite youtuber what's up uh, wolf has quack okay mm Okay, where's Wolf? I guess Wolf's not up here yet. Anyhow, let's get to building, because that's what we are here to do today. We are going to build like crazy, like crazy Robluxians. If the lag doesn't kill us first. Oh my goodness, seriously. Um, I gotta move these stacks. I gotta move these all over. What's your video's name? Uh, well, this one's gonna be um, Gay Lumber's Fixed. Or something, something along the lines of lumber being fixed. Oh my gosh, I didn't know what to do yesterday. I was, I was all kinds of flustered. I even went way over on the tutorials, just because I was like, I didn't get my normal gameplay in. Um, you may have also seen me inside studio playing around. I am working on a game. There is one conundrum that I've, that I've come across. I've actually tweeted about it. So if you saw my tweet last night, um. There is a problem, well, it's not really a problem, but it's a big delay. So, um, for those of you that are developing, or learning to develop, and playing in studio, there is a thing called filtering enabled, which allows you to basically have security, um, so clients can't send stuff to the server, and it replicates across all the other clients. Well, that's a problem when you're trying to shoot a bullet from your vehicle which is locally controlled um, and you tell the server hey I'm shooting a bullet and it's generated on the server and then it's replicated to out all the other servers because there's this thing called input lag I know this sounds really boring but basically the thing that causes the most lag is an input lag and it's also the thing that kills um, the immersion uh, immersion is like the ability to get lost in a video game or the ability to um, the, um, the virtual effect of playing a video game. I mean, one of the reasons we play video games is to escape into a different world, to escape into Lumberland, where I can be a lumberjack and build amazing things. And I don't have to 
you know, I, like the kids are asleep, my normal life's taken care of, and I can come in here and just relax. So, um, the lag is what I'm working on with the, uh, the game. And the name of the game is called Theus. Uh, I'm totally fanboying right now. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Fanboy, dude! Fanboy, do it! Woo! Oh my gosh! You want a selfie? You want a selfie? Hold on, hold on. Let's get some selfies in here. St hey, hold still, hold still, hold still. Hold, hold still. There you go. Come on, dude. Here, I'm gonna hit B and put that back. And cheese! Got a selfie with my YouTuber. Oh my goodness. Photo, please. Do it. Take a picture. Woo! Yay! <laughs> Wait, okay. Mm. I realized something today, and it was something that my wife pointed out to me. So, huge thank you to my wife. Um, she said, what makes Lumber different than any other game inside the Roblox place? I was like sitting there, I was thinking about it, I'm like, you have the ability to build, but there's other games where you have the ability to build. Um, you can play and, and you can get things like money and you can collect wood and she's like, well, can't you do that in other games? I'm like, yeah, you can do that in other games. So what makes it so special about lumber that makes it more popular on your channel. And I thought to myself, like, I don't know. I don't know why I can post a lumber video and it could get like 1,400 views within the first five hours, or I could post a jailbreak video and it gets 300 views within an hour or within five hours. It, it's a huge increase, like 300 times, 400 times as many views. Right? And it's not about the views. It's about me playing video games and having fun. And it, the channel is all about me. And I want to play Roblox. So I kept thinking about it. And she looks at me and goes, do you know why? I was like, no. Why? She said, because your fans have the chance to play with you. I'm like, yeah, but I mean, they could play with me in, in other things. She said, no, 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 no. In here... They can come and help you, or you can go and help them. It is, and that's when it clicked. This is a very social game, and that makes a huge difference. Hi. Hi, 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 hi. It makes a huge difference, having the ability to come in here and actually play with a YouTuber and help them and be on one of their videos. Oh my goodness. And then it clicked. That is a niche. That is the, the key. That's, that's what makes Lumber so special. And... I mean, there's other games that I could go and do tutorials on and everything else, but the one thing that you guys always know is that when I'm in here, you have the ability to join me. So, absolutely, I am going to be play playing so much more in public servers. I will be switching it up and doing more social games. Meep City, I know, is a, a social game, and it's, it's, oh, that was red. It's on the populars list right now. I mean, I don't know why I've not been playing that. It doesn't quite have the same like social aspect um i mean that's one of the biggest things so ink heath ink it's backspace what what it was that that was my throat <laughs> that little pew. that was that was in my throat it was a little bubble a guy stuck is kind is kind of like a mini burp where i didn't actually burp but the air came out of my throat uh, oh, not good. Signs of aging with code. <laughs> Hashtag old people. Um, sorry. And if you, like, uh, uh, she also said, how you've only been doing YouTube a year. And I'm like, honey, it's been 2016. It's now 2018. It's been two years. She goes, well, when exactly? And I said, well, I didn't, I, I actually, I blew up during, like, May... June time frame. That's that's when you guys started watching. You want to hacker? Why would I want to hacker? I am a hacker. I don't want to exploit it. That's what you're asking. Dude, are you like throwing axes at me? Oh my gosh, dude! Is this is this for me? Is this for me? Yay! Thank you. Thank you. Woo! Thank you. Woo! Hi, buddy. 
Please don't push me off the edge. Gamma City. Dude, I like your I like your glasses. Those are actually really cool. The medallion's pretty cool too. What's up, dude? Didn't mean to throw it at you. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you so so much. I really do appreciate it. Well, I I like your glasses, but I don't need a close up of them. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Um, I promised to build on this episode. That was that was my promise. I said yes, I will build. Oh gosh. Promises. All right, let's go here. <clears throat> oh, today's Friday. Um, technically, today is Thursday that I'm recording, but Friday is when this is going to release. So don't forget that there's karaoke tonight. And if you've not signed up and joined the Discord, you're going to need to be in there to go to the Discord karaoke channel. Um, if you have forgotten, you can put in your request for songs to sing or songs for me to try and sing. Um, they are in there. And that happens at 10.30 p.m. Central Time. It's right after the stream. So I start streaming at 9.30 and I go until 10.30. That's usually like... That's the, the best time I can get on and actually do things. I wish I could stream earlier. I wish there was different times that I could stream or record, but I really am limited. So, I do apologize. I keep asking my boss, I'm like, boss man, when are you going to fire me so I can, you know, become a full-time YouTuber? He's like, dude, I am never firing you. You're too useful. I'm like, what? What do you mean I'm useful? Don't say that, sir. He's like, no, you really are. You're... You're a big value to this company, and you push the dial, and and you're a motivator. And I'm like, no, I'm not. Just stop it. Stop it. That's lies. You're just lying to me. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, no. Did I do that entire thing in the wrong grain? <gasps> you know what? You guys are just going to have to deal with it. I'm not I'm not redoing that. I might come back later. I'm, I'm finishing. This is... I'm code the finisher. We are finishing this out. Oh my goodness, was I able to build out that far? Does that mean I wasn't able to build out this entire time and I could have been? That's not fair. Oh goodness, can can we go one more? I wonder if we can go one more. Please don't tell me I can go. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. Silly goose. Nope, 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 nope. That's not where I wanted to go right there. Okay, okay. Whew. Had me scared there for a second. Thought I was going to have to redo the entire ramp. Start from scratch. Tear it all down. Okay, <clears throat> you're welcome. I'm just so excited. Dude, that is amazing. Uh, I need to get some wires so you can do signatures after the video. Yes. If you get three wires, I will sign what? Uh, sign... Uh, sign your base. There we go. I was gonna say whatever wall you want, and that doesn't sound sound nice, dude. I O I. I O I. Ready Player One. That's a Sixer right there. See that? That's the Sixer's visor. Uh, if you've not seen it, um, I highly recommend you see it. But I also warn you. If you are under the age of 13, do not go and see it. Parents, if you are watching right now, I give you my full honest opinion. The book is not for kids. The movie is not for kids. I would not let my kids go and watch it. Um, when I was reading sections of the book, I had to make an abridged version where there's no cursing, no cusses, and there's, um, you know, there's adult topics inside there. So... If you, like, I'm a I'm huge Ready Player One fan, though. Like, I'm going to be one of those people that's like, Oh my goodness, they left so much out of the movie, it's not even like the book. I have read the book. I have listened to the audio by uh, Will Wheaton. I went out and bought the entire audio uh, disc so I could listen to it uh, in the car. Turn, rotate. So when I say, like, I'm a big fan, I am a huge fan. I know Percival, Artemis, H, Shoto, Daito, all the main characters. Sorrento, he is the uh, 
uh, the bad guy of the Sixers. Uh, John Halliday is the... Uh, is it John? John Halliday. Wade Olson Watts. His initials spell WOW. World of Warcraft. Yeah, it's a nice little nod to them. Uh, I don't think it was that. Uh, anyhow, the book is written by Eric Klein. And he originally started out as a, a screenwriter, I guess. And um, came to realize that screenwriting and movie making... Well, there's budgets. So it kind of limits your imagination on what you can do to write the screenplays. But that's why he got into writing a novel. And he wrote a novel, never expecting it to be made into a movie. So when Steven Spielberg picked it up, he was pretty amazed. Um, he was also a co-producer, co-writer of the, the movie itself. Co-screenplay writer. Oh, sorry. This is this is probably really boring to you guys. But, interesting fact, he wrote a book that he didn't expect to be turned into a movie, so he made it outlandish. This entirely crazy world that you would not be able to reproduce on video or on movies. So, But they did it. Still waiting for the movie to come out on Google Play so I can watch it in my VR headset inside the movie theater inside a virtual world. Add a little tribute nod to the uh, the visors and to the um, to the haptic sets. It's not haptic sets. It's the it's the um, oh my gosh. It's the console. It's the Oasis console for your head. Which, by the way, um, because Roblox is moving into like a virtual reality realm it's been moving there for a while now it's really amazing to start seeing some of the games and stuff that are coming out that oculus rift htc and vive will work on and for those of you who are developing that make these amazing worlds i can't wait to try it out with my vr headset just saying oh gosh that is a lot of blueprints do we even have enough wood to fill in all these blueprints? I don't know, but we're going to try. Here we go. Let's just do this. Just do this with thing. There we go. Anyhow, the Oculus and the Oasis sounds very similar, huh? Huh? No. I was reaching there, so. Anyhow, it's also all about the 80s. Which was the genre I was born in, not the genre I grew up in. So I don't consider myself like an 80s kid, even though 80s is like the time frame that the toys and the video games were in. So when it was 1986, I would have been five years old. And that would have been Mario, Super Mario on Nintendo time frame, I think. About there. Super Mario Brothers. Anywho. Boop, 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 boop. Did we, we did. We ran out of wood, didn't we? No. I need to put a hatch or something over this thing. Because that is a... I was doing homework. You were doing homework. Please make honey. Honey? Please make honey? I don't... I don't understand. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, I gotta turn this on. There we go. We're gonna let that thing bake off for a little bit. And we, is that, yeah, that's short enough. We're gonna toss, toss this, oh goodness. Oh goodness. Come on. The other thing I thought of is, if it's going up vertically like that, whenever two pieces get in there at the same time, it tends to um, lapse sideways. Oh gosh, oh gosh, come on, come on, come on. There you go. There you go, buddy. Uh-uh. Get back, get back in there, please. Please, to be doing this. Thank you. And let's grab this one here. This one here. So we're going to try three. They should fit. And you know what? I'm going to try four. That's probably not going to be that big. And five. That's probably not going to be that big either. 
quick search in the catalog. What are you talking about? <gasps> no, no, no. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Stuck is bad. Stuck changes to um, short. Uh oh. That one's stuck. Oh, sorry. I hit her right in the face. Are you okay? Are you okay? May I help fill in your blueprints? Yes, absolutely. Uh, wolf quack. Done. Yep. What is this? What is this? What are those? Oh gosh. Uh, I didn't even think about this. How far along are we on the recording? Oh, we're 20 minutes. We're good. We still got like a good 10 minutes to go. There we go. Okay. Help fill in the blank spots. We got the power and no one's not. I don't know. Got this one. And then I can throw that in there. I'll just grab this one. Get out of the way. You didn't flank the first time. Hi, buddy. Picked up. No mouse, by the way. Sorry. Well, how are you picking things up? Or moving? Oop. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Thank you. There we go. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Teamwork. <laughs> oh gosh, that's a little one. That's because it got off center. Dude! Teamwork, teamwork. We're working in our teams. If there were no lag, this would be much quicker, by the way. My PC's so laggy. Yes. Uh, my base does that mostly. So I do apologize. Here, I'm gonna start moving these over so we can build some more. Build some more amazing base, code primate in your face, or something like that. I don't really know. Um, let's go rotate. All right, so let's move and let's go rotate like that. There we go. Oh gosh, is that okay? Here we go. E, move, drop. E, move, drop. E, move, drop. I should probably build a uh, plank maker over here, shouldn't I? Or a one, one unit chop saw. It would make this job much easier. Just saying. Basically what I've done is I've gotten a lot of gold wood I've got the power, and I'm building an entire base out of gold. Now. As long as I'm still around, hopefully I'll have a ton. I'll have an entire base made purely of gold. I'll, I'll be like the, uh, what is it, the King Midas of uh, lumber. For those of you in history class, King Midas was the... Emperor who wished to be able to touch anything and turn it into gold. And I don't know if it's King Midas or what it was. But anyhow, he got his wish granted by a genie, I think. And basically, everything he touched turned to gold. Even when he um, tried to eat food, he couldn't because it would turn into gold. And then when he tried to hug his daughter she turned into gold and a whole whole bunch of things that it the moral of the story was be careful what you wish for you know kind of thing anyhow all right let's no no what are you doing code oh my goodness oh my goodness i'm not walking that whole way jump Woo. takes a shorter time to go directly up instead of having to walk up that entire thing and good and we're good all right did it chop all the wood is all the wood chopped it is not why are you not falling through please there you go 
You're supposed to be standing up on end, but I'm, I'm not going to complain too much. Just saying. Come on, come on. There you go, buddy. Hmm. Oh, oh, wait. Where did I... Okay. I'm going back over there. Move. Now we're going to go rotate, turn, rotate, turn. Right? Like that? And we need one more rotate, I think. There we are. Now let's check the pattern before I go off building again. Okay, these two patterns are matching, so that's just the way that we're going to go for the rest of this. And away we go. Move. Right there. Good. The garage is getting hot for some reason. By the way, if you guys didn't know, my studio is in my garage. That is a little tidbit of information. A lot of you have said, hey, why don't you do a, a setup uh, tour? Well, because my garage looks like most garages and it's kind of messy. Um, if you want to see what it looked like before, um, I do have a old video of me basically cleaning the garage to make room for my new studio. Which is where I'm at now. And yes, I have a green screen behind me. So the reason that you don't see anything behind me and I'm not in a little box like normal, the box is still there. So I mean, you can you can see where the box is, but that's the, the green screen effect. And that's inside OBS. If you guys were wondering, probably not. Probably like, just build code. Why are you taking so long to just build this ramp thingy? Well, that's when I would explain about the whole ADHD thing, but I'm, I'm not going there. Not tonight. I will explain ADHD many, many more times in the future and now. Mm. By the way, also thinking back to like, I did start three or two years ago, like in Roblox. That means if you're a new fan and you've just joined the channel, and two years ago you couldn't talk? Whoa! Welcome, newcomer. Welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy it. I hope I make content for your age. <laughs> I do. It's all family friendly. It's all good. And, it, you know, it's just me showing off my building skills, giving the morals to the stories, and sharing life experiences. Oh my goodness. I love these videos. The ones where I'm just talking and building. Because it's not scripted. I didn't plan to talk about anything. I didn't plan to come in here and, and build on the gold ramp. I didn't plan on lumber actually being fixed today. And I think it's the impromptu ones that I love the most. But also, I think it's just talking. I like hearing myself talk. And if you didn't know it, I do lo like and watch my own videos. So. Alright, outro time. Outro time! Hey, what what? What what? I haven't seen you in a second. Alright, come on everyone. We're gonna do an outro. Ooh, careful buddy. It is time, right? Oh yeah, we're like right at 29 minutes, so it's going to take me about a minute to, you know, jabber for a little bit. Oh, thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. For those of you that were worried about Lumber Tycoon 2, he does listen and he does fix. So just tweet to him if there's something seriously wrong, like base is missing or um, if somebody's hacking... The only, the only one that I've seen that actually exists is somebody flying around. And that is a client side, not harming other players kind of exploit. Um, if you see somebody come on your base and start actually taking things off your base, that is that needs to be addressed and you need to tweet at defaultio. But for the most part, filtering enable is on. He's got scripts in place and I, I don't know of any thing that allows somebody to come on your base without you whitelisting them. 
So anybody that's tweeting out saying, oh my gosh, I just got hacked. Somebody took everything off my base. You probably whitelisted them. So just be really careful. Don't get scammed out there. Be safe. Don't ever give away your passwords to anyone. Don't give away any kind of personal information. It, all the way down to like what time of day it is for you. Seriously, no little tidbit of information. Because a true hacker or somebody that's like truly dangerous will probably look like your bestest friend. And that's, that's one of the most scariest things is in today's world, the bad guys don't look like bad guys. Okay? So be very careful, especially online. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. I will talk to you very soon. Uh, did I say don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and all that good stuff? If I didn't, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the video like a good YouTuber. Uh, you'll also notice that my shirt does match my shirt today. I'm sorry about that. Somebody called me out on that the other day. Um, love you guys. Have a great night. And we'll talk to you very soon. There you go. 31 minutes. Wow. Good job, Code. Outro. Thank you.